<laughs> I'm joined now by Nathan Lowe, the indie dog whisperer, as well as Dodie and her granddaughter, Ashlyn. And we've had some drama in the family because Ashlyn has a new Great Dane puppy in the family, uh, and, and you were a little afraid. Yeah. Yeah. So, so basically what happened is I, got, I get a desperate message from Mimi, as she's affectionately known. Dodie is also Mimi. Yes, Dodie is Mimi, not Graham. I got corrected, right? You corrected me. So Mimi um, messaged me and said, we have an issue where the dog is kind of exciting around her to the point she's panicking, which makes the dog amp up even more. Yeah. And the kind of, can you explain kind of what was going on at home just real briefly? What was happening? She would... Um not lunch for her, but she just wanted to cuddle her. Right. So one day she got her pinned on the stairs, uh -huh. and so I had to pull the dog off. And, and this is Ashlyn wanting, wanting to. No, the, no, the dog great is wanting. Oh, I, see, I get. Okay. Winnie All right. is wanting to uh -huh. hug Ashlyn and and cradle her. Yeah. But we found out through Nathan that she was making whimping sounds that made Gwenny think she was a playmate. Mm, this sounds and familiar. So they, <laughs> I know. They um. She just wanted to play, but, you know, Gwenny's so big and so strong that she was just terrified, and they're eye to eye. And, and we should point out, Gwen, Gwenny was kind of nervous today, and that's why we decided not to bring yeah, her on. Yeah, she was nervous in the studio. Now. Yeah. Uh, and, but she's a super sweet dog. She is a good dog. She is a good dog. And, and the dynamic, too, is that, Ash, and Ashlyn, what did, you wanted to be friends with the dog, right? Yeah. Did you? But what, why, why did you feel like you couldn't be? Cause she like was she's like a big puppy, mm -hmm. and she like snips sometimes and and yeah. Cause she was little once and then she got bigger than you, didn't she? And he was like, oh goodness. And the thing, you know, the thing that I taught them was a kind of a two step two step process. One is they had to learn to claim Ashlyn uh -huh. from the dog. Say, hey, calm down around her. This is our puppy. Yes. Not your puppy. Our puppy. Mm -hmm. That was the first thing. When I went for the consultation there with them, I remember that was the first thing is getting you guys to say because you were real nervous about. <laughs> yeah. And then you're, I said no. Claim Ashlyn from the Dane. Then the Dane calmed down. Then the second thing was include Ashlyn. And we had you help with the leadership of the dog. And what did you end up doing with the dog that first day to lead the dog? Do you remember? Well, she gets excited when we get in the door. And you helped walk the dog, didn't you? So she actually was able to walk the dog after not getting anywhere near the dog. And when she realized the dog would listen to her, and in fact, there's a really neat video I posted about her saying, sit on her own. The dog uh -huh. sits down and listens to her. So the key is, and I think the key, I don't know, this is something we talked about yesterday, claim children. Mm -hmm and then teach the dog that the child is involved in the leadership of the dog. And it's worth pointing out that uh, Guinevere, as I like to call her, is, is, <laughs> is three of Ashlyn easily, maybe yes. four. Yes, right. times the size. <laughs> Gwenny, he called her Guinevere. Is George being kind of silly? I'm a Camelot fan. He's, he's a, you don't know what Camelot is. He's making references that are... <laughs> Uh, so, um, but 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 the solution here is, and this is a, a theme with you, Nathan, which is, you know, we can't act like puppies yes. around our dogs, yes. and and we have got to make sure they understand yes. who is in charge. Exactly, and in the event of of a child, they just will act like a puppy until you educate them otherwise. So you have to claim them as your puppy and say, stay away from my puppy in that way. And when they learn to calm down, the child can learn then to calm down too. And now. I watched you pet her, lay on the floor with her, lead her around. Yeah, she gets excited sometimes, and she's like, and Mimi steps in, says, hey, calm down the dog, and then they, go ahead. And, and sometimes she be nice to me, sometimes not. Yeah, she gets sometimes excited. she gets too excited. Yeah. <laughs> but you know how to tell her, stop it. But it's a whole different <laughs> dynamic in the house now, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. So a little bit of peace. We can all be the, together. The different dynamic is that now Ashlyn is large and in charge, Amber. I just love that little voice. Yeah, That's just too. the sweetest thing. I'm so glad that had a positive uh, outcome. Yeah.